Well, welcome back. If you were looking for unique artwork to add to your space this spring, our next guest creates custom paintings to help you add a little pop of color you might be missing. Absolutely. Katrina Hartwell with Inspired Hands is joining us now. Welcome yes, to Houston thank Life. Thank you for having me on the show. Let's talk about sort of your, your story. You just started yes, one day? Um, yes. Uh, my talent is definitely given by God. I started painting in 2006. I didn't showcase my art until 2009. And the reason that it was 2009 was because I was painting and storing in a garage and in upper rooms in my house. And so a friend of mine came over and she told me, as she looked at them, and she was like, what are you doing with these paintings? And I said, nothing. And so she said, pick a date. And I'm like, okay, pick a date for what? And she said, pick a date. And so she brought me a calendar and I picked a date and she said, plan your art show. Because people need to see the, the gifts that God has given you. And so I picked a date and I had my first art show January 29, 2009. That is so interesting. So when you set out painting, it really wasn't about showcasing your no, art. Actually, it really no. was just something you were doing it was for something yourself. I was doing for myself, yes. Because for me, painting is therapy sometimes. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes I paint based upon how I'm feeling. Sometimes I paint just based upon what I see, um, the vibe that I get from different people. So it's just, it could be anything that inspires me to paint. And your inspiration just guides the brush. Sorry, yeah, Courtney, to no, jump No, 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 let's just jump into some of your work here, yes. like this one next to you. This what one right you? here is yeah. called Explosion. And the reason this one is called Explosion is because this one was actually done this morning. Based upon the Deer Park, uh, the events that's going on in Deer Park, the explosions, I got in the garage, and this is what, uh, this is what came, came to be. This is what came to you. Yes. I almost see hands in the middle. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know if I'm seeing that right, but... And you, you're probably right, because when someone looks at a painting, it's all about what you see. I may see something different, and you may see something different. And that's, that's the beauty of it. That's the beauty of art. It's whatever you see. That's why I say my art speaks for itself. Right. And so, Katrina, mm -hmm. you say also that you are incorporating intentional yes. flaws. So what do you mean by that? I, I incorporate, incorporate intentional flaws because when we look at these pieces of art, for me... I'm reminding of us as I'm reminded of us as human beings, and w we as human beings are flawed, but yet we're still beautiful and unique in our own ways. So I intentionally place little small flaws so that whoever purchases one of my paintings, when they look at it, even though they this painting may be flawed, it's still beautiful. It's still unique in its own way. I okay. Let's move along to this one. Yes. This is twisted metal. Yes. This is twisted metal. This was inspired by uh, something that I was going through in life. And sometimes you don't know which way to turn. You don't know what to do. You don't know who to talk to. And so this is why this was created. I like the fact that it's not just a painting, mm -hmm. that you added in some other forms. Yes. You added in the metal and some texture and yes. the nails and different mm -hmm. things. So that just really yes. broadens the horizon a yes. little bit. Yes. And as we move here uh, to this last painting that you've brought in today, I want to ask you, when you set out to create something new, yes. do you have a vision in your mind of what you're about to create, or does it just sort of unfold? Sometimes it just unfolds. Like this one, actually I had a vision. My son was doing a uh, science project, of course, the volcano. And so this is why this is called eruption. When he finished his, his project, I started my project. And so that's eruption. And how many pieces are you creating? I mean, is it something where you're setting aside time, like this is now a job for you? You know, you're selling mm, paintings, you're actually, creating no. custom paintings? Actually, no. I do do custom paintings, but actually, no. I can be laying in the bed, and if something is in my spirit, I'll get up and I'll paint it. So it just, it just, it just depends. Even I can if be it's 4 a.m.? <laughs> yes, yes, and I have done that. Go in the garage, paint, come back and get back in bed. A true artist. you yes. got to get it on the you canvas, get it on the for canvas. sure. Yes. I love your message to others. Don't sit on your gifts and mm -hmm. talents. Share them. That's right. And um, if, how do people, how can people connect with you? They if, can connect with me on my website, inspiredhands.net or 832-731-6055. Right, there's the info right there on your screen. Katrina Hartwell, thank you so much for stopping thank by. Thank you. Again, it's 832-731-6055 yes. or inspiredhands.net. Thanks so much for stopping by. Thank and you, guys. Yes, I thank appreciate you. it.